Welcome to Juice for the Journey for kids today. Children, remember the song, He's Got the Whole World in His Hands? Well, let's sing it together. He's got the whole world in his hand. He's got the whole world in his hand. He's got the whole world in his hand. He's got the whole wide world in his hand. God has everything and everybody in his hand. He's got the little bitty baby. He's got your brother and your sister. He's got you and me. God has the fish in the sea, the animals, the flowers and the trees. God has got the whole world in his hands. You see this globe? Wow, this globe. I love it. I want to make sure you're seeing it well. This globe represents, it's a picture of how the whole world looks like. Isn't that? This is small, but the whole world is big. It has all the countries, all the oceans, all the cities, the towns, all the fields. Now, what I want you to do is cover your eyes. No peeking, no peeking. Cover your eyes, cover your eyes. And I want you to get a picture of God holding the world in his hands. You got that picture? God has his hands and the whole world is sitting right in his hands. Okay, now you can open your eyes. That is how big God is. Wow, he is a big God. Now, let me see how smart you are. Come on. So does that mean that God has your little puppy, your little dog in his hand? You're not sure. Well, is your dog in the world? Yes, your dog is in the world. Okay, I have another question. Does God have your games and your toys in his hand? Yes, you are right. He does. Now, does God have your house and your car in his hands? Yes, he does. Right again. Now, does God have you in his hand? You are so right. You are so right. My goodness, you're getting so smart with this. Remember, God has everything and everybody in his hand. Job, one of the books of the Bible, tells about a man. And his name is Job. In, his, in, in, in chapter 12, verse 9, 9 and 10, this is what Job is saying. He says, God holds all things in his hand, every living soul and every breathing creature. One of the men, Job from the Bible, this man, he talked about how big God is and he said, God holds all things in his hand. I don't know about you, but that makes me really happy because there is nobody bigger than God. He can watch over you and me all at the same time. Now, I want you to stretch your hand as wide as you can. Stretch out your arms, stretch out your arms. Wider, wider, wider. Oh, look how wide you can stretch your arms. God is bigger than that. He always knows what is going on. And he's watching over you and me to help us be safe. 
Remember, he has the whole world in his hand, and that means you and me. Amen? Amen. So let's pray. Lord, help me to always know that you have me, my family, my teacher, my pastor, all in your hand. I believe that there is nobody bigger than you. Thank you for loving me and me being special to you. Amen. Amen. I hope you're saying that prayer today. Now remember, be safe. Wash your hands. Always wear a mask when you go out. And above everything, remember God loves you. Thank you so much from your pastor, Thomas. We'll see you another time. Bye.